Ah, very fancy. You have music playing. There's a shot glass just sitting there. That's funny. It's Chief Gustavo. This better be important. Uh, what can you tell me about the basement? I don't care about the basement right now. How do you feel about having a few dual neighbors? Hell no. <laughs> Ten penny won't allow it. And I take my orders from him. What if Tenpenny will let ghouls live here? He'd be out of his goddamn mind. Like I said, ultimately, I work for him, so whatever he says goes. But I wouldn't like it. I met them. Roy Phillips and those other ghouls don't seem all that bad. Look, kid, I don't care what you think about them. Unless Tenpenny says otherwise, they aren't allowed to be in the store. We've wasted my time. He's an asshole. Alright, I have to go. Well, I don't know what the layout of this place is like, or where all the people are. The Federalist Lounge. Oh, it's a nice robot. Shakes. Hello. Welcome to the Federalist Lounge. I'm Shakes. Wet your whistle. I love a drink, friend. I see, sir. Very well. May I pour you a drink? How would you feel about having a few ghoul neighbors? Don't have any data in my files about that. So he wouldn't give two shits. He's a robot. Uh-oh. I don't want to hack that and then he'll attack me. Something else over here. Play some pool. Play some pool, man. Cool jukebox. All right. What do we got? New urban support. This is a clothing store. Where the hell is the person who runs this? They're not even in here. Fucking store where no one's manning the store. That's weird. Okay. So what's back here? Men's and ladies room, okay. Hey, these are the cleanest toilets in the wasteland. Look at that. <laughs> Men's room, obviously because it has urinals. Good attention to detail in this game. So it's just bathrooms back there. What else do we have? Oh, who's this guy? Oh, it's just a generic security guard. Forget that. Penthouse Tweets is probably where Tenpenny is, so I want to investigate everything down here first. Cafe Bean Monday. <clears throat> oh, there's a bunch of people in here. There's a doctor I already Good talked to. Good to see you. Anthony Those Lane. Those clothes are atrocious. You should stop by my shop. New urban apparel and freshen up that look. Upgrade to fabulous. <laughs> How'd you feel about having cool neighbors? Shoot. Serious. Cools aren't human. Oh, this guy's gay. And filth. They eat their own babies. They eat their own babies? The right freaking mind. <laughs> I met these ghouls there. Civilized and pose no threat. Why would you hang out with dirty vermin like that? You enjoy sifting a few feet. Jeez, this guy's a prejudiced motherfucker. You know, it's only a matter of time before they get hungry and eat you. You're crazy. Ghouls will never live in Ten Penny Tower. This is happening. You're going to have to deal with it or get forced out. <laughs> you'll regret this. I've spent years collecting all this fabulous merchandise. I won't stand for this. Where the hell am I supposed to go? I'm sure you'll find something suitable. The only suitable place is Ten Penny Tower. Everywhere else stinks and caters to low-life scum like you. I'll die out there. I just know it. Well, too bad for you, you fucking asshole. My name is Tiffany Cheng. My miserable excuse for a husband is Comrade Irving Cheng. <laughs> and you can tell him I said so. He put up with a lot from your husband, eh? Do you know he tried forming a committee to discuss the ghoul situation? A committee! He made himself chairman, of course. <laughs> what we need is somebody to do something. Not just talk about it. 
don't suppose you know anything about ghouls, do you? I dealt with enough ghouls in our, our area. Stop worrying about those ghouls. I wish I could. I get nightmares from time to time. How do you feel about having ghoul neighbors? I don't know. I mean, they're all deformed and scary looking. I bet they're really mean, too. I met these ghouls. They seem friendly enough. Well, you seem like you know what you're talking about. I guess I'd be willing to give it a try. I might not spend much time with them. But if they do anything stupid, I'm sure they'll get kicked out. <laughs> Fine. It's okay. So go tell Mr. Tenpenny. I guess so. Nice. I have to go. I'll talk to this chick now. Have you ever considered performing, what do they call it? Lydia Montenegro. surgery. You know, were you... I am Lydia Montenegro. I'm sure you've heard of me in my shop, Boutique Le Chic. No. Obviously, you don't travel in the right circles. I can't talk now. Visit me at the boutique during business hours. When the hell are business hours? Yeah. You're new around here. I'm Margaret Primrose. I run the Café Beaumont. Stop by sometime. How would you feel about ghoul neighbors? Oh, I know. You've been lobbying for those ghouls, and I've already been thinking it over. Huh. I guess I would be willing to give it a try. Huh. Tell Mr. Tenpenny. I have to go. All right, so let me see if that girl's going back to her shop. The newer so I can convince her. The Stavos guards are swift to death. Oh, who's this? Well, well, what have we here? Allow me to introduce myself. Whoa. I'm Susan Lancaster. Perhaps we can become better acquainted in the near future. Wow, forward of you. You bet. I like meeting new people. Me too. <laughs> Especially rich, fine young men. Hmm. Listen. You look like you can handle yourself. You survived out there in the wasteland getting here, after all. You ever have to deal with ghouls? Ah, what a subject. Ghouls aren't so bad once you get to know them. Fine. Never mind. <laughs> I thought you were a real man. Oh, boy. Turns out you're just a scared little boy. How would you feel about having ghoul neighbors? I know all about your plan to get your ghoul pals in here, and I'm putting a stop to it. You can't just go around pushing us around like that. Wanna make a bet? I've dealt with people like you before. People who think they know what's good for everybody else. I know what's best for me, and that's no ghouls. So you can run along and tell your ghouls they'll just have to find somewhere else to squat. <laughs> she thinks she's but in charge? Yet, what are you, crazy? Go and die somewhere. Speech 100%. It's happening, so get the fuck out. I'm done with the wasteland. And I've been everywhere else. There isn't anything better than this. Uh -huh. Damn you and your ghouls. You just have to put up with it, you bitch. I'm not going anywhere. I'll talk to Tenpenny. I bet I can live in Burke's place. He's never around anyway. Uh -huh. And when he does come back, I'll make sure he's fine with the new arrangement. You slut. You dirty slut. I'll just send up for my food. I love you. I'll never <laughs> even have to look at you or your ghoul buddies. You now, dirty slut. Only get the residents to start eating them. All right. Here she goes. We keep with sheep. Hey. Would you fucking go in your store so I could talk to you? This better not be a Oh, I can talk to her now. All right, how would you feel about having a few ghoul neighbors? Ah, yes. I was wondering when you'd try me. You may be able to coerce the others, <laughs> but I'm not such a pushover. Your zombie buddies will need to find someplace else to live. Oh, no, you don't. Speech 100%. You horrible little zombie lover. <laughs> what right do you and your disgusting buddies have to push honest, hard-working, important people around like that? Because I'm the man, Where and you're you not. Fuck you. you. You'll find something soon. Don't worry. Did you just step out of a vault? Haven't you seen what's out there? I'm doomed. And it's all your fault. Me, 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 me. Shut the fuck up, you whiny bitch. married to the biggest idiot on the planet. What? <laughs> this is a generic security guard, right? Yep. All right, what's down here? The wellness center with a gnome. Intact garden gnome. Can't take anything here or else they'll kill me. The doctor's not in here. 
There he is. But I've already talked to him, so. Alright, I guess I need to go up the stairs and see what's on the second floor. Anyone who I need to convince up there. <laughs>